Warriors. The Warriors. What a jump! What a jump! Happy! This time they know the truth about us. What a jump! The world's gonna start over. And this time we're on top. And this time we're on top. Pokoda Boeva! Pokoda Boeva! Pokoda Boeva! Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Shazam, the iPad producer, and I'm here with Oreo Studios, and I got a a revamp video. It's basically one of my videos that I got a lot of views on. Uh, I think it was like a uh, sixty thousand views or something like that. Uh, and that's iMachine. So we're gonna go ahead and dive into iMachine and see what's up with that. iMachine Two by Native Instruments. Um. When this app first came out, I was pretty geeked about it. And then when they revamped it to iMachine 2, I was pretty geeked about it. So I wanted to do a little Wakandan tribute to uh, iMachine. So, um, I got a few samples here. Now, the one thing that I wanted to go over on how I got these samples in here is the reason why I wanted to go back over this app. Um, if you go to this top tab up here, uh, where it says iMachine, you go up there to that little red dot and the little lines. That's your menu button. So you tap that, and your, your option is to do new, open, save, yada, yada, yada. So we're going to go new, okay? I'm going to go to discard. And so... Um, when you do a new project, for some reason, it doesn't wipe the slate clean. It literally just clears the program and the song format, but it leaves the same, uh, it leaves the same things up here. As far as it didn't change, you see how it didn't change none of my kits. So that's one thing I don't like about that. So we're gonna go all the way over here to this empty one, all the way to the bottom. And if you go to this little eyeglass or magnifying glass to the left in the menu button, you have six menus. You have the eyeglass, you have the little meters, and that's like your parameters and things you can do to manipulate the MIDI. Uh, then you have your sample, which you can edit a sample, record a sample. Uh, like if I wanted to record a sample right now, I'd be like, Wakanda. Um, this, I don't know. It didn't work. Let's see. Wakanda. Oh, okay. I see. Threshold. So we're going to bring the... <laughs> I'm an idiot. <laughs> All right, here we go. Wakanda. Wakanda. Okay, see? There you go. So that's pretty dope. I like that. Okay, so... And then you have this little... Uh, what is that? A pencil tool? And that's where you can deal with your scenes and your patterns. And that's how you... Your step mode and it's... It's a little, little more to, to do. So we're going to go back to uh, the eyeglass or the magnifying glass. And when you go to magnifying glass, you have like a sub menu kind of at the top. The 16 pads equals your, that's your favorites. These are my favorites that I have so far. Um, your expansion kits. I like that because it's kind of laid out like uh, in a machine, the software, which is pretty dope. And then you can go by kits and all that good stuff and then you can go to the next little squiggly line it looks like a wave that would be your sample so you can go by drums when you if you want to build your own kits instruments uh loops and so forth and so on i mean it's categorized not too bad i kind of like how it's categorized and then if you have your own it'll go by uh your samples and then your little pads okay so and then this little uh music note most of the time is uh itunes so when you hit that, that lets you know what you have in your iTunes. I don't think I have anything on my iPad. Uh, it's all on my phone. And then the the other little, what is that, a plus and a wave sign is how you add samples from audio copy. Sorry, audio paste. Forgive me, retro names, audio paste. Okay, so when you tap on that, it opens up uh, audio paste. And then it lets you see all the things that you have in audio paste, the things that you've purchased and the things that you have loaded down here from iTunes file share. So when I go to iTunes file share, I go to my Wakanda kit and I go to samples. And then when I 
made these samples. I made these samples in Beatmaker 3. And um, it used, uh, it named them whatever the USB or whatever interface I used. If I would have used a mic, it would have just said probably internal mic. I used the USB audio device, some little cheapo USB sound card that you would get for like a PC. It's pretty dope. Anyway, so when it's like this and you can't really see uh, what the samples are. This I am Prince T'Challa, son of King T'Chuck. So it's pretty dope. King T'Challa. King T'Challa. King T'Challa. Just bury me in the ocean. Okay, so let's say we want to pick one. Then we would, let's say we pick that one. Uh, for some reason it failed. Not quite sure why it failed. It's probably because I'm doing too much right now. But that's basically how it would do it. And it would add it to that pad. So let me try another one. Let me see. Let's go to audio paste. And then I'm going to go to, let's go to something that's already in here. Let's see. Okay, yeah, let's go to that. Okay, now you can trim it, which is kind of nice. And then you can import it. That's one thing I forgot to do. I forgot to trim my samples. So then it puts it in the sample folder, and then you are allowed to name it. Or, oh, nice, because it's audio paste it names it what it's already named okay cool nice so then you go to save okay so now i've already for the sake of this video wakanda, i've already made a kit the protector of wakanda i never freeze It's time they know the truth about us. It's time they know the truth about us. It's time they know the truth about us. We're warriors. The world's gonna start over, and this time we're on top. What a trap! Drop your weapon. Would you kill me, my love? For Wakanda? Without question. Okay, so these are some of my little quick. So what I did was I made two little little funky Wakanda beats, little Black Panther beats. Um. This kit I custom made. It's got some stuff in it. Uh, certain. So, you already know I use that. Okay, so, and in here, I don't think. I don't know if I used any of those. Wakanda. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna play for you the two tracks that I made in iMachine and go through some of the effects and things that you can add and then what we're going to do is this is not interapp audio it's no audio units still or it's not an audio unit there's no midi import so it's basically what you get is what you get i mean if you go to the little mixer page you can st see we still have two little funky tracks or four Sorry, little funky tracks with two of the mixing section. Now, I kind of like how they, uh, not mixing, but the effects section. I kind of like how they did that with the XY pads. So if you, I'm going to play you what I did, and then I'll show you the effects that I put on them. Okay, so here we go. Or here we don't go. Oh, okay, you know what? I need to load the song. Okay, maybe I should do that. Okay, so I'm going to go here to the top left where the little squiggly line is at the top and the menu button. Then I'm going to go to open. Mines or user. <laughs> yeah. We're going to go with Panther. Let's try that one first. We'll go to discard because I don't want to save nothing on accident. Okay. The protector so, now, of Wakanda. Of Wakanda. Of Wakanda. Now, if you see, that's... That's with these effects on. So uh, you can hear how they sound dry. Wakanda forever! Wakanda forever! The oh, protector well, of Wakanda. Okay, so that's a little dry. So then right here at the top is the reverb. So we're going to add some reverb the on it. The protector of Wakanda. It's 
pretty nice. And then we're going to add a little disease lay. The Here protector of Wakanda. Of Wakanda. Of Wakanda. Now, one thing I don't like is it applies these effects to the entire 16 pads. I never, so freeze. I never freeze. I never freeze. Drop your weapon. Drop your weapon. Drop your weapon. I mean, I must say, I do like the sound of these effects. They're very, 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 very nice. So we'll see. Let's see what, what we got here. I'm going to mute this because that's... Let's, let's hear what we got here. We'll hear what it sounds like without the effects, and then we'll play it with the effects so you can see how it adds some little meat to your potatoes. Wakanda. The warriors. What a tribe! Okay, now we're going to add some effects. Wakanda. Wakanda. The warriors. The warriors. What a tribe! What a tribe! Okay, so you can see that it's got a nice little long tail on it. I like that. So now what we're going to do is we're going to add a little, a little percussion into it. This is just something simple, so don't think I was making a whole track. Now we're going to go ahead and bring in the uh, extra credits. This is this is the special sauce. <laughs> Wakanda. The Warriors. The war what a tribe! What a tribe! This time they know the truth about us. What a tribe! The world's gonna start over, and this time we're on top. This time we're on top. Wakanda forever! Wakanda forever! Wakanda forever! Wakanda forever! Okay, so that was the first track. That one's Panther. Now we'll I'll play you. Uh, let's we'll, we'll play Wakanda. And I don't want to save anything, so we'll go there. Bam. Okay, same basic kit. I just uh, didn't do all the colors. All right, so let's see. Let's see what this. Drop one. your weapon. Did you kill me, my love? Wakanda. Oh, Wakanda. Drop your weapon. Drop your weapon. You can be my love. You can be my love. Wakanda. Question. Drop your weapon. You can be my love. Wakanda. Oh, Wakanda. Without a question. Wakanda. Drop your weapon. Drop your weapon. Wakanda. You can be my love. You can be my love. Wakanda. Question. Drop your weapon. You can be my love. Wakanda. Okay, so now with the effects, let's see what kind of your weapon. We so. your weapon. Okay, let me go ahead and load it brand new. Okay. The protector of what this time they know the truth about us. Okay, let's see what okay, we got reverb. Let's see. We'll go over. You guys know what the delay sounds like. We'll see. I'm just gonna go over some of the effects and then you guys can see how the effects sound with some of the song or with how how it affects the song excuse me we're gonna start dry and with only one i'm gonna go ahead and cut this off so it won't confuse you guys so we're only gonna go with effects number one okay here we go wakanda wakanda the warriors the warriors what a job what a job Okay, 
Okay, cool. We'll see what. Okay, we'll start dry. Wakanda. The warriors. What a trip! Bambi! The protector of Wakanda. This time they know the truth about us. What a trip! Bambi! Okay, that's coarse. Then we'll go ahead and try flanger, so we'll go dry. Wakanda. The warriors. What a trip! Bambi! The protector of Wakanda. This time they know the truth about us. What a trip! Bambi! The war. Ooh, I. I kind of like that. That was kind of nutty. Okay, we'll start dry. Okay, so I'm assuming down here in this corner is where it's dry. Yeah, yeah, that lo fi is nasty. Okay, we'll start from no effect. Try. Wakanda. The warriors. What a drive! We'll switch between the filters. This time they know the truth about us. What a drive! Start over, and this time we're on top. Okay, and then you also have a mix section up here, so you can mix it. So we'll go. Wakanda, the warriors. Okay, now we're let's let's add another effect in there. Let's let's double up. So we gotta enable it over here in the mixer. So Wakanda, the warriors, the warriors. What a trip! The protector of Wakanda. This time they know the truth about us. What a trip! So that's a cool little little section. So when you mute it, those are your mutes. You can see when you mute something, they go inactive. Okay, now if you want to change the color of your groups, you just hold the mute button. Oh, sorry, I'm sorry, take that back. It's not on a mute level. Okay, we go here. Here's where you do it. You would hold, tap and hold, and then you get your options to use keys, recorder, save kit, or color. So I'm not gonna change my color. So right here, let's say I wanted to change colors, bam. So that a whole tap and hold, we're gonna go with a little baby pink. Okay. So when you go over here, you just go here. Let's say I wanted to save kit, I go save kit, it'll put it there. And then you name it. Wakanda. Okay? So Okay, so that's I mean, they haven't really done anything with this yet i mean i like this little section you can this is where i told you you can play with your parameters and down here where it says off and then you have your um options for different types of um i believe that's note repeat so let's try it so that's cool like when you want to do hi-hats you can hit them triplets The trap hits that everybody, <laughs> the trap triplets. Okay, sometimes I forget to turn it off. And you can, there's your velocity, and then that's your full volume, I believe. Right here, that's your volume, and this is like your.
So that's pretty cool. Okay, so let's turn it off. Okay, so that's pretty much it. I mean, it's cool. It's not really, it's not Beatmaker 3. It's not iMachine Pro 2. I mean, iMachine Pro 2 blows us out the water. But I'm going to tell you, Beatmaker 3 is more like iMachine should be. Because Beatmaker 3, boy, I mean, Intua, I, those guys are amazing. Because I came from Machine, so the scenes and programs, I get all that. I never really use it anyway, but I get it all. So maybe I'll do um, a series on Beatmaker 3. Uh, I'll do a series on IMPC Pro 2. Because those are pretty much the only two beat making apps that I really utilize. I should use Beathawk some more because it's an AU, so audio unit. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this short. This is your boy Shazam signing out for Oreo Studios. Um, let's just so you guys, if you guys want to see some of the stuff that I have, how I have my iPad organized. I got my DAWs that I use. I have my beat machines that I have it's my synthesizers then I got my instruments that emulate instruments instead of more synths um, these are the apps that allow you to program trains from a MIDI controller then that means change of the sounds I'm a preset surfer so I'm also a sound designer which is like an oxymoron but maybe I'm, I'm an oxymoron these are all my audio units slash plugins. Um, like I said, I'm an audio unit. Oh. Yeah, that is me. Dude, look, there's some new apps. My cloud apps. Ladies and gentlemen, if you don't know about Dropbox for $10 a month, you get a terabyte. Lord Jesus. I think Apple gives you 50 gigs for 99 cents. So that's pretty dope. Then here's some of my video apps that I use. So then I got my little Adobe Suite. But that's pretty much it, ladies and gentlemen. That's uh, that's what me have on me iPad. Then me got me test flight. Uh, I'm signed into my other. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I'm out. Warriors! The warriors! What a The protector of Wakanda. This time they know the truth about us. What a chance! What a chance! Happy! The world's gonna start over. And this time we're on top. And this time we're on top. Wakanda forever!